Hi, good afternoon or good morning or good evening, whatever time of day it is for you. But today I just wanted to casually come on and uh, just do a little um, video about sharing with you five of the YouTubers that I enjoy watching. And I enjoy watching them um, on a pretty regular basis as much as I can. I try to catch, even if it's just a glimpse of their newest video that they've posted, but I do enjoy um, watching these particular YouTubes, YouTubers, and I'm going to list their information down below. And um, I'll give you just a little briefing on each one of them as to why I enjoy their channel. These aren't done in any special order. It's not like my first or my fifth, but these are just five that I frequently watch and the reason the and just my own editorial as to why I like watching them. Um, one of them is the Style Chronicles. Um, I believe that she originates out of um, the Houston, Texas area. And I have been watching her YouTube channel. Oh my goodness. I think her oldest girl might be eight. And I started watching her when she first had her. And I, and she has two other children since then. But her channel is The Style Chronicles. And the reason I like her is because, number one, what attracted me to her was, first of all, her hairstyle. And I wore my hair in that classic bob style. And she always had her um, bob cut up in the back. And I was just very attracted to it. And I suppose one time going through YouTube looking for some different hairstyles that I might like, I came across her channel. And I tuned in and I just loved how she presented herself on the channel. Second reason I love watching her channels is because she is all about her family. She has three um, active, gorgeous children. Um, she has a husband that she just loves and adores. But the other thing that attracted me to her was that she has such a loving relationship with her family and her family is important to her and her heritage and her relationship with her dad just so reminded me of my relationship with my own dad. So there began our history or mine basically because obviously she doesn't know who I am but I will say that I have communicated you know, back and forth with a couple of these YouTubers and they've always responded. And so I think they're genuine and honest and I love the content that she puts out. And mostly she does an outfit of the day. And my favorite tip from her is, one of my favorite tips, but one I can share with you, is her tip on how she picks out the color of her blush to match her lipstick. And basically, whatever blush she's looking at to wear for that particular day, she will match up a color of lipstick, and that's how she comes up with her combination. I found that to be a really helpful tip, and that's from a YouTuber, The Style Chronicles. Um, another uh, one that I love to watch, another YouTuber who's very popular. It's uh, Makeup by Camilla too, and um, I watch her English channel. She's beautiful. Um, obviously, she's, you know, very model-esque, and uh, she has a great YouTube channel. She talks about a lot of products that aren't just all high-end. She shares herself with you in a very normal, natural way. She brings her family on occasionally, um, and she just has a really a lot of good content. Not only is she gorgeous and beautiful to look at, she has a very, very soothing voice. And she just reminds you when you see her that she's just one of those people that you just would love to get to know. And uh, she uh, she used to, um, and a lot of times say, you know, she would kind of teach you a little English word for um, her language word. 
And so she's just easy to listen to. She's absolutely gorgeous to look at. She has beautiful style. Um, I love the way she um, does her tutorials. And um, it she's just she has a very fun channel to watch. So I think you can learn a lot from her. And another YouTuber that I love to watch is L Florence. And um, Elle is out of um, Canada, and she is just an awesome YouTuber. Her channel mostly is about fashion, um, for especially for the um, women in the uh, working world, corporate world. Um, she does a little bit of um, cooking. She does a little bit uh, a segment on her channel also um, with reading and um, her favorite reads. She does a lot of, um, she's doing vlogging. She does um, a lot of videos that she brings her mom on and she shares her uh, experiences with her mom. She does a little bit of cooking, but she does a whole lot of fashion and get ready with me and uh, her favorite tips for her hair and cooking. She loves to cook. And so I would have to say that I enjoy Elle's channel um, a lot because I think there's such a variety and she happens to be one of those people that you just feel like you know and she's easy to get to know through her YouTube channel. And so I have learned, um, I've picked up a lot of good tips from her. I love her decorating style um, and she gives really honest reviews and um, she's also an entrepreneur on her own because she does have a jewelry line um, it's called Nouvelle Pearls and I'll also link that below and um, it, she's just a great youtuber to watch I love shopping at Nordstrom's that's one of my favorite stores and she does quite a bit of um, shopping at Nordstrom's and I just love to see um, her newest or latest purchases and um, she's very good about sharing information and so I think she's a fun youtuber to watch um, next, I love to watch Laura in the Kitchen, Laura Vitel, and because number one, my background is I'm Italian, love to cook, love to eat, and Laura is a beautiful, beautiful YouTuber herself. I love of her channel that she has also for makeup and just I love everything about her. She's uplifting, she's fun, and she puts together awesome recipes and I've made several of them and so they're real and authentic and just she's just fun to watch. Another YouTuber that I love to watch is Dominique I'm going to spell her last name, S-A-C-H-S-E. She is a reporter out of Houston and um, she's also so fun to watch. You just see her on that screen and it just makes you smile. It makes your heart smile. I love her channel because she is not afraid to tell you on her channel that she admired something that she saw on someone else, like a purse. And so she goes up to that person, just, oh my goodness, I love your purse. Where did you get that purse? And she's not afraid to share that information with you. So she's not afraid to make a purchase that somebody else has or that she admired and she shares that information and I love that. I love that when people do that. I just find that attractive. I find that it's helpful to other people and that she can be inspired by something that she sees from someone else, whether it's a purse or a piece of jewelry or a scent, you know, she's not afraid to say, oh my gosh, I'd love that for myself and then I want to share it with my viewers. I love that. And when she ends her video, she always says, oh, I'm probably going to forget, but I'll caption it, be bold and be beautiful. And I love that. And I think of that to myself. 
um, in my own personal life when I'm coming up against something or I need to think about my inner strength, be bold and be beautiful because beauty really starts from inside and illuminates to the outside, I think. And so she's one of my favorite YouTubers that I love watching her channel. And um, another one that I love to watch is my fifth one, um, is Kristen Gem. Um, and I'm not sure, I believe she's up north and I wanna say the Chicago area, but I, or Michigan, I don't know. You'd have to tune in to find out, but I love her channel because number one, I trust her opinion. I trust all of these YouTubers that I have named. I do trust their opinion and I've trusted them enough to say, you know what? I think I'll give it a shot and I'll go purchase something or, you know, maybe I will try that based on that person's opinion. Um, but Kristen, when she shows up on camera, um, she's just, she has the most infectious giggle and laugh. And um, she just brightens the screen. And um, her laugh is just infectious. And so a lot of times I just have to need me a pick me up and I just, I had to go see what Kristen's talking about today. She has great tutorials, um, great get ready with me. Um, she's really gives you all the details about her purchases and she doesn't leave anything out and she's a fun person to watch. So what I think all of these YouTubers have in common, for me anyways, is that they're inspiring um, and they share a lot of their own personal thoughts and they're willing to share with you and they kind of give you a glimpse of what their own life is like and um, they're so inspirational um, that it, you know, it's just makes you want to go and sit there and just kind of tune in to maybe just get inspired. Maybe you need some new decorating or a new recipe or you want to see, hey, what's the latest mascara that's out there? So I kind of go and rely on these favorites for me because they're not all high end and they do do drugstore pick-me-ups or, um, you know, some of this is my favorite routine at bath time or this is my favorite hair routine and um you know for example the style chronicles she loves target so she kind of keeps me updated on some of what's going on at target l florence she's club monaco and um nordstrom and I, I just love watching those youtubes when she's talking about those types of things and um I know uh, Elle Florence and uh, Laura in the Kitchen, of course, um, and even uh, um, Makeup by Camellia, they talk about foods that they like and they share photos and pictures and um, they're just great channels to watch. So if you're looking for somebody new, tune in to one of them. I don't think you'll be disappointed. Just my opinion and a few YouTubers that I really like. Bye. Until next time, everyone, be kind, be humble, and age gracefully.